What's up you guys? Um, today I had to go uh, get chemicals to clean my pool and not too long ago I actually saw a video um, from another YouTuber of the King of Random. Um, he did a video on mixing two different chemicals which was like powder um, chlorine and dot three brake fluid. So today I actually thought about going to the store and picking some of that up and actually not too far from a house I actually have a pool supplies so I'm actually gonna do that and go pick some up and we're gonna see what goes on it's actually a pretty cool reaction with what he did he had in a glass and then a water bottle so we're actually gonna go ahead I know he said probably not a good idea to do this at home but I mean sometimes you get curious and you want to do it on your own which which is me so um, I will let you guys know when I pick up all the materials for this and I will have the rest of that done in the next 15, 20 minutes. All right guys, we're and we're back. So I was able to pick up the dot three brake fluid and also the Power Power Plus chlorine shock. So let's actually combine the two and see what happens. All right, so let's go ahead and get this going. So you're gonna add the same amount of the chlorine powder as you would the brake fluid. So let's say, it's really just a fine powder. It's really, really fine. It's very thin. And you can take your dot three. Probably about the same until it you want to move it around. around. It'll take within a minute to a minute 30 before it reacts. And we'll get right back to the reaction. Guys, and that is what's left after the chemical reaction between the brake fluid and the chlorine gives you this black crust, which is left, which is nothing but the crust. Melted the cup. That's about it. Thanks guys, I appreciate you guys watching this and
continue to stay tuned for more 